25-year-old Alexis McNeely is suspected of stealing drugs and tampering with syringes and vials on multiple occasions. That's right. KPRC2's Bill Barajas has been on the story all day for us. He is in the Webster area to learn more about the reasons behind the crime. Well, according to court records, when asked about why she took the medications or drugs, she replied, I hear voices telling me to do it. Court documents say this all took place between April and May, with a few instances being caught on camera there at Houston Methodist in the Texas Medical Center. McNeely has since posted a total $30,000 bond on those charges. She was released, and we came out to her Webster area neighborhood to ask her about her arrest. We tried knocking several times, but nobody came to the door. 25 year old Alexis McNeely facing three counts of diversion of a controlled substance. Court records are saying McNeely repeatedly stole drugs from the hospital by swapping out syringes and vials, carrying hydromorphone and fentanyl from a vending machine used to dispense medicine for hospital staff. Upon further investigation, those records went on to say and allege that McNeely drew up and replaced those vials and syringes with normal saline solution and then placed the tampered vials and syringes back into the automated dispensing machine. The medicine back in circulation then had the potential to be administered by other medical professionals to patients unaware that the medicine had been tampered with. There's also allegations in those court documents that include McNeely possibly injecting herself in the hand with a fentanyl syringe before returning to work. When confronted about the video evidence, court documents say McNeely admitted to, quote, gaining access to the drugs, but said she just threw them away. We reached out to Houston Methodists about the allegations and obtained this statement. They said, quote, this employee's conduct was unacceptable and never tolerated at Houston Methodist. The employee was fired immediately and law enforcement was notified. We have extensive safeguards in place to protect our patients. And this isn't the first time McNeely has faced these uh, sort of allegations. Uh, she was formerly employed by the Baylor University Medical Center in Dallas in 2022. Court documents say she was terminated after they were made aware by other nurses that McNeely was creating several suspicious overrides in their drug dispensing system. In Webster, Bill Barajas, KPRC 2 News.